Dress, Jesse. Oh, he's nine. Oh, and by the way, I'm keeping him off stage because, uh, well, I don't think the stage is a particularly healthy place for a child. Sorry, I'm late. Um, I, I, I was studying for my calculus test and it was really interesting and I got really into it and I, I guess I just got kind of like lost in the whole track of time thing. Um, uh, uh, you can stay out later if you want. <laughs> uh, don't worry about me. Stay out till 11, 12, 1, 2, whatever. <laughs> Uh, well, you have our cells? And no rap you can try to get him to bed by 9.30. See you eight, woman! Oh, no problem. We always find good stuff to do. Have a good time. Probably your fault. You're a terrible mother. She didn't say that. No, I didn't. But you're right, that's what I think. She did say. You may want to get him tested for attention deficit disorder. What? They'll have to give him special tutoring, extra time on tests. Oh. And believe me, you'll be glad when the SATs roll around. Listen, I know people who actually try to get their kid labeled ADD, so they'll have an advantage. Oh, jeez. Well, like I said, we don't even know if he has it yet. Right. But I know what she's thinking. Your kid is the poster child for ADD. He's a hell of a lot more hyper than mine. He's a little menace to society on that bicycle. <laughs> Uh, so tell me, my friend, what's going on? <laughs> well, uh, our psychologist's working hypothesis is anxiety, but there's also been the mention of the possibility of ADD. <laughs> oh, please. You should have seen me when I was a kid. You too? They called me Flash. I had two speeds. Fast and get the hell out of my way. Uh, these are the symptoms of attention deficit disorder. Short attention span, impulsivity, distractibility, lying, blaming others for your mistakes, uh, other... Symptoms include poor judgment, trouble learning from experience, risk taking, and conflict seeking. <laughs> okay. Bush has ADD. Hey, at least it doesn't stop you from becoming president. 